Hey y'all, so I really have a no build van build. This chair here, I bought it off Amazon. It was under $200. I think the name for this chair is Galantix, but there are a lot of different chairs just like this that are just different names. So this chair here, and I may have showed it before when, I was, when it was in my storage, but it just lets out like this. You just roll it down and then the back, just wait a second. Uh oh, now you wanna act crazy. Okay, so as you all can see, that is the chair here. It feels like a cot. Um, I put a yoga mat on top and a blanket and it makes it feel really, really good. It doesn't bother me because it's low. I would prefer low than really, really high. Y'all will recall that I had somebody build me a bed in here and it was too high. It was like I was laying and, and you could see me in the window. So I really, really didn't like that. So this chair just goes back up like this. This is just my August, y'all, a little something, something. Okay, you see it like that. And then I just let the back up like that, and it's a complete chair. Now, in my van, I'm cleaning my van. That's all I really need. These carpets here are just carpets I got from Walmart. I got stuff on the seats because I'm cleaning out the van. So what I do is I put this chair here. The back of the chair has to go up against here and then I let it out. It is perfect size. It is the perfect size from here to here. And then I lay on my seat so it connects perfectly with my seats. And I'll show you all that here in a second. And um, then that box over there, that's my nightstand. All I need in my minivan, camper van build out is something to sleep on and a nightstand. I had a table, the nightstand, I mean, the, that box over there, it actually, you can flip it over and you can use it as a table or something like that. But let me come back and I'm gonna show y'all all, all everything set up. But real quick, I wanna show y'all something. This is a new addition to the van, this rug here. I just washed it, I dried it also, but I also wanted to let it dry a little bit more in the sun. So I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna show you all the rest. So to give y'all a continuation, so up here, the front seat, I don't want to take this passenger seat out, but you see how it kind of has, it has to go farther because of this back that's on this chair. Now, I don't, I don't let this back down in order. If I was able to let the back down, I would have to remove this chair or remove the back seats. But this, this chair that I have, that folds up this folding chair like a folding bed, it is exactly the size of this seat. So y'all, I lay from here to here, perfect. I don't have any problems doing so. I lay curled up, but even if I wanted to lay stretched out, I can. If I wanted, again, to have this chair removed, the passenger seat removed, or my back seats removed. I love my back seats, y'all, because I sit here with a desk and I just type. So this is all I need, a bed. I consider that my nightstand, that little thing there, that the bag, that red bag is on top. Right in there, y'all, I keep stuff that I need access to right away. So that's what goes in there. In this red bag, I have like a spray vinegar bottle, a spray alcohol bottle. I have paper towels and just miscellaneous stuff that I need access to right away. There's the Jackery that I won. And let's keep going. So in this trunk, y'all, I got plenty of room in this trunk. First, let me show y'all my stickers. Full Tiny House, Tina the Outsider, Mo Bang for Your Buck, that's Tim. Justin and Christina's RV Life, Box Van D, Tiffany of Where's Tiffany. So in here, y'all, I have three crates. The bottom crate down there is just the very bottom crate. It's under here. I don't know if you all can see it. See this crate right here? This is just miscellaneous stuff. Y'all know I love candles. My youngest son got me this candle. This middle crate right here is my food. This third crate right here is my clothing. This crate is my, um, just my miscellaneous stuff. It has a blender for smoothies. Here is my emergency toilet. It just stays back here. Um, I got rid of the bucket. The, they, these are the shades. Uh-oh. I can't even get this. These are the shades back here that Proud Mary made me um, to go in my windows. 
the top windows i don't have anything for the back windows and um in here is just my miscellaneous this is just deep woods this is this ant and um flying because it'd be some campgrounds you go to the insects be flying those flies be they don't even like they don't they don't care that they don't they don't go away but i'll fix that later these are my two bags i wear a lot of head wraps so this is just my hair bag and then this is just my um you know clean up bag when i go to planet fitness or whatever and down there is my cooler and that's all i need in here y'all i can have if i wanted to in this trunk because it's so deep i can have tr i've had as much as maybe six or seven crates in here and um, i've had crates under the cooler i've had so much stuff but because i have a two-room storage when i'm in town i don't need to carry around all that stuff what I'm thinking about doing, if I keep this minivan, I own this minivan. I paid 12 cash out the door for this minivan. If I keep this minivan, I'm thinking about getting something that attaches to the back. Just a little crate. And that's just because when I go out west, um, you know, I may need extra stuff like my sleeping bag. Or I might want a little small barbecue grill. Just my extra things. Um, if I don't get solar, and I may get solar... Um, but if I don't, and this is probably blocking y'all out, I'm going to get also a thing that go on the top, a carrier. So I just wanted to give y'all my van and let y'all see it. I do need some curtains um, right there because that's why the tow truck people, you know, I need some curtains that go up there. And it's just that I am going to do all that stuff. But anyway, y'all, this is August. Just wanted to like keep y'all updated with these videos every single day. Thank you for watching and supporting the channel. If you don't mind, give a thumbs up. Make a little comment. Um, if you are a YouTuber, share it. I'll share yours. Thank you so much. And as usual, take the joy route.